I thought we would go over another very uh, famous sort of movement in Tai Chi, in fact a movement that every Tai Chi style is going to have to some degree, called Cloud Hands. Now Cloud Hands is performed in a few different ways, but the basis of it is a circle in front of you with your hand. Now what we're going to do today is, based on the Cloud Hands we practice, is I'm going to take my left hand and bring it up to my right shoulder, and I'm going to draw a circle across and down and then do it again. So there's the circle. It's a very basic movement in a certain way. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to have both hands working together. So now my left hand comes across and my right hand does as well. And you can really see that this is cloud hands now. Okay? So we work on this from lots of different elements. And it's all based on the fundamental Tai Chi principle. The whole body's moving as one unit. The connection to the center is always kept as the movement continues. We work with partners, and we have the partner helps us make sure that we're doing it right. And this is one way that can be achieved. So if you come here, please, and start this way. Okay, go forward. Good. Is I'm going to do this movement, but he's going to do the same movement. So now we're doing this movement together. Here, can you move this way a little bit there? So here, I'm practicing not only doing the movement, but controlling the wrist as it comes around. And now what he can do to make it more challenging for me is as this is happening, he can be pushing forward or pushing back to try to make sure I go off balance. So I, my job is to stay in balance with whatever happens. And that becomes a really good exercise because this represents so much about self-defense dynamics, about how punching and kicking and wrestling and grabbing go. So that's the push hands with it. Now you can see it if you use a right hand punch. And I go around and take control of the hand for various reasons. Or he punches with his left, and I take the hand this way, and I come around. The final thing I'll mention though is we did have two hands in motion. So if he punches with his left, and I go here, this hand can come up and strike here, and set up to do different techniques. So this motion creates a whole bunch of openings. And it's not just for throws, not just for um, jiu-jitsu type application, but it could be for striking. You could do a left-right punch, one, two, one, two, right? Or I could do it this way, right, left. Right, I'm clearing to the inside then. All of that just off cloud hands. And they call it cloud hands because it kind of resembles clouds, but also you should be serene and calm like the sky. So if he punches really hard with his right hand, I'm just calm. To what I need to do. And thank you very much for the help. That was Cloud Hats. Thank you for your time.